this is the first vlog I'm taking of my vlog. Oh, wow, look at the sweat. Look at the sweat. Oh, my word. So I, so I have just done two runs of my competition piece for K-pop festival, um, Korean Embassy of Ireland, Dublin. It's on Wednesday. But these beautiful people came to watch me dance. And I was wondering, let's scoot in. Let's scoot in. I was wondering if you guys have anything, any advice for me on Wednesday. Remember what the Bangtan crew is about, <gasps> bro. BTS. Yeah. What if I lose? No, no, no. What if the it's judges have bad judgment? Okay, <laughs> and in that case, like, we feel sorry for them. I'm sorry. You made wrong choice. You made wrong choice. <laughs> <laughs> choice. You you. I just don't win, exactly. Oh, Lisa, I like that. <laughs> so, you are who you choose to be. And yes. what do we choose to be today? People who believe Fierce. in magic. Fierce magic. Yeah. Anything else? Mariella? <laughs> Everybody express your feelings with your body. Go. <laughs> it's just we should have done the whole interview like this. than I have been the last couple of days. I think it's because I can't do anything else. There's nothing more I can do. So I'm just gonna dance now. It's my only job, which is what makes me feel better. So let's do this. Yo! Not for the actual performance because I think we're all gonna be too nervous to be <laughs> But if you guys want to introduce yourself, I'm Gail, I'm 19. Oh, I'm very Trisha popular. and I'm 13. Hey, very and good. And we're both originally from the Philippines. Lovely! But we live in Dublin. I am Sarah, I'm 12 years old and I'm Irish. So, do you want to tell me what you're performing today? We're performing a mashup of 17's Adore You and Winners Really Really. Um, yeah, Trisha's on guitar. I'm on ukulele. Yeah. yeah. Oh, ukulele. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, I heard them in rehearsals. They're amazing. Sarah, what about yourself? What are you I'm performing? Performing Blackpink as if it's her last. So how did you get into K-pop? Her. <laughs> when I was like eight, she introduced me to K-pop. It was Girls' Generation, Run Devil Run. My friend introduced me to K-drama, like Boys uh, Over Flowers, and that led me on to Shiny because yeah. they're OSTs. And yeah. <laughs> yeah. And Sarah, how did you get into K-pop? Uh, from my sister. Ah, uh, cool. What was your first band that you listened to? I want you guys to express how you're feeling with your body. Go! <laughs> we have one. <laughs> Yay! Thank you, guys. Hi, everyone. Everybody say hello. Hi. Some more lovely people that I've met on my K-pop journey. So if you want to introduce yourself, go. Hi, 
my name is Silson and I'm gonna be performing Seventeens Don't Wanna Cry. <laughs> Hi, my name is Alex and I'm gonna be performing Lee Michelle's uh, Without You. Yo! Hi, I'm Shauna and I'll be singing uh, Big Bangs If You. And how did you guys get into K-pop? K-drama, Descendants of the Sun, guys. I recommend it. I'm watching it at the moment, Descendants of the Sun. I recommend it. Sorry. Lastly, I want you to express how you're feeling with your body. Go! Pig! <laughs> <laughs> Show us that again, that was amazing. <laughs> Alex, go. Oh, oh very perfect K-pop idol. <laughs> Hannah, there, set, fighting! Hey guys! <laughs> yeah, we're really excited. We've just passed Kildare and we're almost at our destination. This is me before I go on stage. This is what nerves look like, my hand is shaking. I feel really good, just really nervous. I'm eager to make myself proud. I don't know what will happen and that's okay. So let's see what happens. I am who I choose to be today. I choose to be amazing.
the results is I didn't place at all, uh, which is definitely not what I thought was going to happen. And that was a very strange feeling. Um, but what's funny is that like I had normal rush of old thoughts that I used to have when I was younger and went for anything, which was like, I'm a total outsider. I'm never, go I'm never gonna be good enough. They're never gonna accept me, all this stuff. But what was really funny, like I'm, I'm, I'm sad. I'm pretty sure that I'm sad. But what's really funny is that like I also had like I looked at this. We were given free Korean food, and I looked at my plate of food before I walked up for the announcements, and I was like, this is the coolest thing. And I, ate, I also spoke in Korean to the people who served me the Korean food. So I was like, look at all the food. And then um, I got to speak Korean. I got five incredible women who, like, before I we even went to eat, I had we had a woman's circle, and then when I was crying, we had a woman's circle, and I was able to cry and just be sad, and then not change. I didn't change or get worse. Like, oh, I'm I'm sad, and I feel a little bit ostracized or like not seen I don't feel seen but that then I had like six seven eight people who were in the competition with me who came up and and said amazing things and I had a girl who was so shy and came on her own to the competition and come and say amazing things and I made new friends and I was seen I was seen just not by the people who sat on the judging panel so it's all good it is all good. This is Riki Like Magic. I remember you are who you choose to be. And today I choose to love myself and be happy.